start this up. All right, video's paused. Who to tell? Um, maybe not that one. Uh, what's this? Oh, that's right, um, Handelabra. <clears throat> Here's your ping! Whoop. Uh, and... Oh, right, in the realm of Discord. I definitely want to do it there. up. Okay, good. Nobody's here yet. That's fine. Let's do this. Oh, okay. Uh, let's make sure it's actually here. It is, in fact, actually here. We've got six heroes, we've got six villains, and we've got six environments. Which, yeah, that was, I actually knew that. Or did I? Hello, Insom. Um, so I, I'm going to have a lot of uh, audience participation here. Um, I'm going to just go through the heroes two at a time. We'll do three games. Uh, I'll just go through them in order, more or less. So we'll start with Anima and Arunia. Um, what I would like from... Hey, Leslie Lemons AF. Is that... Are you, are you Lemmy? But you're not new. Um, I would like chat to suggest which villain environment uh, canon hero and cauldron hero I should play because uh, rather than showing like a whole bunch of original heroes at once it's always cooler if you can get the uh, the interactions oh okay all right good I, I thought that was what it was I just hadn't gotten for sure uh, so where the hell are they up oh, they're down here for some reason <clears throat> oh, there's okay. So we yeah we have Noxaturna, uh, who is mostly text <laughs> apparently. Is she really the first one? Hang on, is she really the first one alphabetically? <clears throat> uh, no, not Mythical Comics Legends of Calistar. Yeah, okay. It doesn't start until Noxaturna. Wow. All right. So yeah, Anima and Arunia. Anima, Arunia. <clears throat> See, I hate group by expansion because I can't remember what's from what in here. <laughs> hey, Iron Moose. How's it going? So, yeah, anyway, uh, our villains. We've got the evil Nox Eterna, who is trying to bring about Everlasting Knight. Remember, these are all very original characters. Uh, Princess Veritas Vitavis Vittoria, who's getting married and everything's okay. Sorceress Betris, who's been corrupted by a powerful amulet. Hey, Zerami. Uh, Turn the Destroyer, who's a big, big evil guy who's going to steal all of our magic and then destroy everything. And the Equalizer, who is an evil sorceress who wants everybody to be equal, meaning equally weak. I think she's the last one. Oh, and Professor Buccellini. Don't forget him. Professor Buccellini and Tlatawani, uh, 
an ancient being who is seeking relics of power. <clears throat> there is, in fact, not a super chaotic guy. Um, he, due to digital limitations, I have to redesign his deck. So that will be coming in the future at some point. Also, who? Oh, John, it's you. Okay, I couldn't read you because your name is very dark. Uh, but anyway, give me a villain. I'll go through the environments real quick. <clears throat> and again, this does this not start until it doesn't. Oh my god, because they'll start with the uh, Sol Invictus. Okay, we can do a Sol Invictus. Uh, we've got Stillwater. Uh, which is the peaceful town where our heroes live. The Templar Proving Grounds, which is the uh, training area of the Sky Templars, which uh, our, our hero Rainbow Rider is a big fan of. Uh, the Decimation of Time, which is about like it sounds. A friendly farm that serves fruits. There sure is in still water. Let me go through these real quick. Uh, the Defiled Woods, which is where Nox Eterna's spirit was sealed away, and uh, that's why it's defiled now. <clears throat> Not the Delhi of Disaster. Uh, the Frozen Empire, which is an entire kingdom that was frozen beneath the earth by an evil sorcerer. And I, the end the land of Kalistar itself. Uh, okay, so I heard uh, Sol Invictus. There are, of course, a couple of variants here. So we have Nox Eterna. We have, um, actually, Amori Caritas, that's right, that's the evil version of uh, Princess, what's her name, Princess Vidi? I can't remember, and Sol Invicta. I think that's it, right? Yeah. She's the one who isn't all text. Good gravy. Friendly farm that serves fruits. Still water. All right, give me a cannon hero and a cauldron hero. <clears throat> Excuse me, and if you don't get in this one, there will be another. <clears throat> Trip V. <Yeah. laughs> it's Origami Swami. Somebody, everybody, say hi to Origami Swami. He is the architect who made this possible. Um, how do I give you a thing? Uh, let's see, I see Cypher and I see Writhe. Okay. Writhe. Um, let's see, Arunia should go first. Anima can go last. Oh, wait, no, Cypher should go first. Uh, where is he? I can't spell. <clears throat> I'm going to do that one. All right. Uh, yeah, we'll get back to those other suggestions with the next game. Let me, real quick, uh, Community Roles Manager. That's what I'm looking for. Uh, add new. See, unfortunately, um, the way I have this set up here is this screen is over that screen, so if I need to see anything over there, I gotta do something. Argami Swam... Oh my god, why do you make me do this? There we go. You get one of those. Boom. What? Why? Fuck you. Fine, whatever. I'll figure that out later. Okay, here we go. <clears throat> uh, oh yeah, question. Did you find any music by any chance? Or are we doing default stuff? bow mortals before the omnipotent might of the sun. I guess I should put the new heroes first. Uh, we got a guard captain coming out. She's going to deharmonize us, and instead, uh, when a villain card is discarded, we put a token on this card, and uh, when a villain one-shot would enter play, discard it, and she gets the two highest for two fire damage each. Villain relic make her flip, and if she gets four tokens, she flips. We want her to flip with as few tokens as possible. Ooh, yeah. Okay, that's fine. I uh, I honestly didn't even think about it. 
and I don't know where I would go to get, like, original music. Uh, that's not helpful. That's not help. Wow, buddy, you... You are not having a good day, are you? Cypher, what the hell is your problem? <gasps> mm, excuse me. <clears throat> Alright, so Rooney has got a duplicate dispeller. Uh, Fenwick's fail safe, which is not going to be useful in this fight. Well, not a lot. Maunach's method. I think it's Minach, actually. And Oleg's dark heart. Let's start with that. Uh, she will deal some infernal damage to Sol Invicta and the guard captain. <clears throat> hey, Nezu! Ooh! John subbed with Prime again. Four months. Awesome. <clears throat> Yeah, they can be. Uh, we're going to use her power of magical study to draw a card. And we got another copy of Fenwick's Failsafe. Alright. Uh, wow. Let's just start hurting things. I want to get rid of her if all possible. This is my new uh, digital mod. <clears throat> uh, which icon? So this is, uh, this is Arunia. She's our main character. She's come to the peaceful town of Stillwater to learn about magic and stuff. This is Anima, her very shy friend, who has uh, little animals that she can summon. Alright, which one are you? <laughs> uh, let's see... Oh, well, Faltar is cool. Um, let's start with Buka. He's a vulture. She heals him. Ooh, we got the Orthros. And because he's not at full HP, we don't get to guide his damage. Oh, okay. <clears throat> we got an Ebijalg. It's going to try and clone itself and then eat our little friends. Oh, she got a relic, so she flips and hits us all for three. How dare you. <laughs> cool. That actually works, I'm glad. Yes! Heuristic algorithm, give me a freaking augment. You asshole. Um, let's put that on a writhe. He's probably going to be our damage dealer. I'm doing pretty good, honestly. I mean, I had a... I had a bit of a rough morning, simply because I had to catch a bus really early to get to my doctor appointment. Oh, do we want to teleport? But I had a friend over all afternoon, and we had a good time, so I'm feeling good. Mm, now let's not teleport, let's do Fenwick's Failsafe. Get rid of the Ebijog, and that's it. Uh, more settled, yeah. All right, Skimaki. Let's play that for the hell of it. Ooh yeah. Yeah. Um, as as Leslie pointed out, if you see anything that looks out of place, say something in chat so Origami Swami can uh, catch it. Ooh, a major move in April or May. Let's go for the Orthros. We need some of her ongoing cards so she can get set up. No, fewer animals, damn it. Long Jean comes out. He's part of the Strong Clan. Ooh, makeup! That's exciting. I just wore this. Uh, he's going to be dealing some damage to the villain targets for us. Thank you, big guy. Oh, that's interesting. The background thing, on the front the hands are like this, and on the back they're like that. It's such a small detail, but that's cool. <coughs> Lunar Guard comes out. Uh, don't punch Anima. That's evil. Let's see. 
That's going to heal people. There's no thingies there. I mean, I'm going to... No, it's not weird. Everybody knows. It's fine. Oh my god, can you please draw a useful card, my guy? Ah, oh, not your turn. Like, keyword matching the turn and play. Okay, no, no, that. Ooh, let's get a, a book out. Enchanting Elixirs and Fantastic Physics. We're going to use that to distribute some card draws using uh, Fidelma's Facial Furnishing. <clears throat> Cypher gets a card. Cypher gets another card. <laughs> God damn it, Cypher. Ryan, you need a card. The player may play a card now. No, I don't think that's worth a book destruction. Why is it the shadows, question mark? No, don't hit Long John. He's our friend. Okay, Dorcha, who are you? This card may deal a target to sonic damage. Let's go with the bat. <clears throat> um, what I really want is, well, A, people who know the original characters would be helpful as, like, Inspiration, not as direct translation. Oh, hang on, we got a friendship test coming out here. Um, but I definitely want, you know, superhero comic type things. Uh, so let's see, let's select the heroes of the most infused cards in hand. Um, exception, getting special strings. Please report the problem to the mod author. Okay. When one of those heroes plays a card, the other must discard a card. At the start of the environment turn, if they both have the same number of cards in hand, they each regain 3 HP. Draw until they have five cards in hand and destroy this card. Okay. Uh, so the fewest is going to be Anima, and the most is Cypher. Oh, good. And Long John punched the guard for us. Oh, she's hitting us for some damages again. Um, you can take two. It's fine. No. Yes. Let's prevent two damage. Oh, and it redirects, that's right. Uh, Sol Invicta is immune to fire damage, and I believe immune to radiant on her back, I'm not sure about that. <clears throat> that's a good question. Uh, Alright, let's rapidly prototype here. Uh, we will discard the bear call, we don't need that. Very possibly. So you're telling me you didn't get any augments or anything else? God damn it. Got so many Lunar Guards, but there's no sense in getting rid of them. Um, do not draw a card. I think we're actually just going to get rid of that. It's not worth it. <clears throat> oh, I should have done that first. Shoot. <clears throat> Let's do me next method. David's Desire. Oh, interesting. Oh, specifically because... Okay, that's fine. Um... <clears throat> we need him dealing damage, or I would use one of those. Alright, Concentrated Anima. Pets and non-hero character targets have no end of turn effects. You cannot use powers. At the start of your turn, destroy this card. That's not really useful yet. Let's put out Faltar. He's her little angry bunny friend. He's very protective of her. Oh, the Orthros is back to full now. So he gets to do more damage. Yes. Um, might as well kill the Lunar Guard. <laughs> Tonight I'm done. <laughs> Solid reference, I love it. Alright, the weather wrangling. End of the environment turn. Deal each target two cold damage. 
Each player may discard a card at the end of their turn. At the start of the environment turn, each player may move their trash to the bottom of their deck. And if at least 12 cards are moved this way, one player may put the bottom card of their deck into play, then destroy this card. Oh, so we need one more card in a trash, so I don't even have to worry about it. As long as somebody plays a one-shot, we'll be fine. Uh, okay, wait, who do I actually want to... No, it's not worth it. Screw y'all. Whew. Winter's coming early. There's a one shot. <coughs> Another Lunar Guard. He brings out all of his friends. Yes. Hmm. Ah, and there goes Faltar protecting Anima. <coughs> Shoot. Oh. Yeah, Wrath could use a card draw. Ooh, that was good. Um, we want to keep that. <clears throat> doesn't need to discard a card even though he has plenty he's not in here yet he will be coming in the future okay let's send a missive to the sorceress Arunia's uh, mentor the sorceress Thea ooh there's her setting that would be nice actually I mean Incas is great you know, actually, no, he's better. Play him. And then I'm going to use the duplicate dispeller to get rid of that guy. <clears throat> Ooh, she got her soul gem. Wow. Uh, yes, I want to draw a card because he deals fire damage. <clears throat> oh, whoops. Um, hmm. Do you conceal the assailant? I'm going to have to get the cloak back. Uh-oh, 10 cards total. Shoot. Quality pet time. First time any pet enters play each turn, it regains a hit point. Play up to three pets, each regains a hit point. More than one pet enter this way, destroy this card. Let's go ahead and do that. <coughs> so she unfortunately has to discard her hand. Ooh. Um, there's not 12 cards in the trash, unless this counted wrong. 3, 5, 8, 11, yeah, that's, um, <clears throat> oh, may move there, okay, never mind. Yeah, yeah, he is, I actually have to redesign his deck from scratch. Ooh, the Gadfly came out. He's no fun. <clears throat> uh, let's just let it go. Don't destroy the Shadow Cloak. <coughs> <coughs> that ought to get us some more cards in the trash. No, apparently. Another one shot. She's wearing us down. Cypher, you suck. <clears throat> oh boy, she's gonna flip. <laughs> <clears throat> yes, let's destroy that and just set it to the gadfly so it can punch her. <laughs> That's great. Heuristic algorithm again. Fusion Og. Ooh. 
that's going on anima. What do we have here? A nearly spoiled wedding. Um, oh, that brought out the gadfly, okay. There are two more cards in this deck. Put them on the bottom of the decks in any order, then destroy this card. If their deck is empty, put them in the trash instead. And he's indestructible right now. Let's just get rid of that. Well, no. <coughs> Oof. This is going to be rough. Yeah, discard a card, buddy. Just, just to make sure. Okay, we're good now. Let's do Soul's Magic. Yeah. Start doing some damage. Oh, that's going to go to the Gadfly, though. Hang on. <coughs> just draw a card. Yeah, no, that's exactly what it needs to be. <coughs> I'm just gonna do a little little bit of damage. Hit the gadfly. Ooh, shit. I'm going to have to look at every trash, see what would be useful. Ooh, Wood's Edge Cottage. Excellent. Um, what do you do? That's the butterfly. Let's play him. <coughs> and then we'll go ahead and use the cottage. Everybody can heal one. Oh, I got a bear call. Orthros takes out the gadfly. Hooray. Oh, okay. <coughs> Take out your own guard. <coughs> <laughs> okay, so. <coughs> Cyborg punch, kind of useful. Uh, Electro optical cloak would be very useful, actually. Well, there's our answer. Arunia. <clears throat> hmm. Oh, good. Whew. So it didn't actually let me change the order. Uh, let's see. Gadfly. <clears throat> oh, good. This gets rid of the Lunar Guards. That's great. Um, sorry guys, you're gone. Desi Duma comes out. <laughs> oh good, that'll heal Cypher. <clears throat> no, the Gadfly is actually, um, uh, the Bugbear. The, uh, the Ebajog is... The pair of sprites. Wait a minute, I thought we were... Oh, wait, no, shit. That's right. No, 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 stop. The electrical optical cloak only protects Writhe. Okay, um... We're gonna save Anima. Oh, wait, we don't have to. We're gonna save Arunia, then. Destroy the Shadow Cloak. Ah, she's not immune to radiant damage. Everybody else die. Woo! Thank you for the posture check. Everybody died, except for me. You know why? Draw a card. That sounds great. She's down there, but she's beating the shit out of these guys. Well, like Stark Heart would not be good. Uh, let's do a miss up to the Sorceress again. We got Books and Branches Library. Ooh. Hmm. Or Paracelsus. No, we want Paracelsus. He's great. Yeah, we need more cards. Anima needs a card. Riot needs a card. And Anima needs another card. 
That's not bad. <clears throat> hmm. Do I have a card other than a spell? I do not, so let's go ahead and do that. Um, get back a message to the sorceress. Sure. Um, I need to get the freaking shadow cloak back again. God damn it. <clears throat> Alright, what do we have here? Rabbit senses. Oh, that would actually be nice. Yeah, let's do that. We are going to heal. Writhe. And then she's going to heal herself. Attacking on in Carnival, hmm? Oh, well, it's the Strong Family Reunion. One more players return one of their cards and play to their hand. Strong clan with the highest HP deals the villain target with the highest HP X melee damage, where X is twice the number of cards sharing a keyword return this way. So let's see what we can do. Um, okay, Writhe has so many things. He's got equipment. Yeah, we could do an equipment and uh, the book. It's also limited and ongoing in house. Ongoing and Lies of the Shadows. Yeah, let's do that. Lies of the Shadows, back to hand, and then Anima can do Rabbit Census so we can get the interplay uh, thing again. I'm sorry, what? <clears throat> oh, that's right, there's nobody out. Well, whatever. I actually wanted to put those back in my hand. Uh oh, it's Drader Guard. Paracelsus, congratulations, you're the second highest. She can heal. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, he somehow did not die. Place this card each one, increase the next damage, don't play a hero target by one. He's got the Shadow Cloak out. Okay. Yeah. Let's do that. Equals one plus the number. Increase damage dealt to Soul Invicta by one. And then Soul's Magic for three. <coughs> what did I get? It's to the Sorceress. Oh, yeah, let's go ahead and play that. Uh, ooh, Brainy Rainy. Yes, please. I would like to be able to heal my hero. Thank you. Lurking Shadows. Alright, time for Ride to do the Sacrifice play. Booyah! That's unfortunately not going to be quite enough. Now listen here. Ooh, I can play a pet for my trash. Um, yes. The Orthros we want back. Heals one. Do please heal. <clears throat> so close. Um, yeah, let's destroy that because there's no strongs out. Town Hall comes out. And it plays the mayor. Oh, hey, all right. <laughs> good, good luck. Uh, so, two players can draw a card, or discard a card and draw two cards. No, three players can. There's two houses in play. Everybody can do this. Excellent. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> For real. Uh, yeah, whatever. Oh, and Anima's actually got a hand again. Let's get rid of that second bear call. And she's got her soul gem. The Umbral Throne! Here she goes! Time to kill everybody! Oh no! 
Oh yeah, that actually ends the game. Shit. He soaks it, and everybody else dies. Oh, so close. So close. Woo! All right. I'll go grab the uh, next two heroes while you tell me what uh, what villain, what environment, and uh, let's see. Somebody had asked for La Comodora, I believe. Uh, I thought somebody had asked for something else. I don't see it. Oh, here we go. Uh, Iron Moose said Commodore and Drift, so we'll grab both of them. Alright, who is next? Debutante. Oh, great. Debutante on the same team as Drift is not going to go well. Heartbeat? And Jackie Strong. Okay, that might be alright. Um, Drift. Which drift do I want? Oh, I want the good one. That one. <coughs> and Locomodora. Who's under C, alright? Yeah. Yeah, you're gonna go first. Templar Proving Grounds? Let's see. Sure, Templar Proving Grounds is great. I love, I love that most of the environments are right here, except for the Delhi of Disaster. <laughs> Correct? Uh, what villain do we want? I can go back through them real quick, if you want. Um, we already did a Noxia turn of variant, so we'll skip her. We've got uh, Princess Vittoria. Uh, we've got Sorceress Betris, Tarn the Destroyer, the Equalizer, and Tlatawani. Who is, whoops, who is Professor Buccellini on the front? Yep. <clears throat> That's interesting. Why is that at the end? I mean, if it were up to me, okay. I was going to say, if it were up to me, I'd take Professor Buccellini. Let's go. Once again, I did not put my hero on the front. Whatever. All right. Oh, right, yeah. The Hitman comes out. We have Drift. Okay, I want you blue. Hero Flight Pool comes out, the training record, and the fill in Flight Pool. Very cool! I like that. Uh, we are absolutely not discarding cards for nothing at the start of the game. Untying Enmity. Whew. Drift cannot deal damage. Okay. And the Idol of Itzelquatli. The secret to this game is draw cards. Um, debutante needs all the cards possible. Well, this isn't a children's cartoon. This is a comic series aimed at teenage girls. Uh, nobody discarded, so good luck with that. Okay. Only designs. Art of inspiration. Design you may play another card. Yeah, or let's see. Sudden Notion? No. Gem Finding Spell? Yes. Good God. Um, I think this is Wagner Mars Base? <laughs> What's that? It's a cool one. Um, I forget if she has special cards. Nope, okay. Uh, Debutante wants to reveal cards. She got her Soul Gem, alright. Jackie, reveal cards. She got a tree. Ooh, she got her good tree. 
Um, Drift will just draw. Play me a discard a card. Draw a card to play a card. Don't have to do that. Um, what did she get? Oh, let's put out Soul's Inspiration, because that's very good. Yeah, we want to draw as many cards as possible. All right, who wants to draw a card? How about Jackie? Not Wagner? Maybe it's Ruins of Atlantis? Oh man, we got her dog. We've got two of her trees. Wow. Uh, let's not bother with that. Fae Fruit is fun. Let's play a Fae Fruit. Somebody can finally deal damage. Um, pop the idol for one, so we have less to pay. And we'll go ahead and discard a card to hit that. And we'll hit the Hitman. Yeah, might as well hit that too. Alright, what are we trying to do? <laughs> uh, second time each turn a hero card is played. Second time each turn a villain card is played. Okay. So it looks like they're going to get an extra card play. <clears throat> Draw two, discard a card. Let's play out of sync. Oh, it's Celestial Tribunal? Okay, I didn't realize that. Let's play on a sink. Past focus. Why not? Just gotta get up to the front. Mm-hmm. Mod graphics not yet available. Yeah, sorry about that. Flag Hunt, so we get a training exercise. Start of their turn, here may deal themselves 2 melee damage. Reveal the top 3 cards of their deck and replace them in any order. The start of the environment turn, reveal the top card of each hero deck. If at least 3 cards of the matching keyword are revealed this way, replace them and we get tokens. Otherwise, the villain does. Whew, this is going to be hard. Yeah, we do not want to hit the villain. And I almost did because I thought he was immune to damage. That was an old version. Uh, who wants to discard a card like Commodore can? Yay. We bought ourselves a relic. We get the chest of Chimmel. What the fuck? The chest of Chimmel Popta. Uh, two players with the most cards in their trash. Each put a card from their trash on top of their deck. That could be very useful. Uh, and the Medallion of Montezuma, who with the fewest non-character cards in play, plays an ongoing or equipment card. Ooh, I like that. I want to keep that one in play. No. Um, debutante. Ooh, let's get that design back on top of her deck. And that could just be a one-shot, I guess. All right, who's got cool shit to play? Um, we could get ship shape out. Let's do that. Yes. All right. So all she's got is one shots. Or I could just try and take time. Alright, so everybody, make sure your second and third card are one shots. Don't need to do that. Oh, right, she's drawing two cards, though. Hmm. I should not have done that. <laughs> Just do it again. Don't do that. Play a card. <laughs> For fuck's sake. Way anchor. Ooh. Ooh. Um, debutante wants random card plays. Femistique. Oh, well. 
cannon portal, why not? That gave us a token. Oh wait, we don't want to use this power, do we? Shit. We don't want to shuffle the decks. Normally I do. Okay, so she drew the take time, so the top two are one shots. Uh, let's put that on Jackie Strong. This guy needs to go down. Yes. Okay, she has a single one shot. Oh, and there's the outfits I need. Fuck. Okay, I'm gonna play that and deal damage. Ruffian. Star of Karajahar. Um, well, let's see. Actually, Drift can draw because she hasn't set the top of her deck yet. Ooh. <clears throat> um, if it's a question of one overruling the other, I would say Concordant Helm should overrule it. Yeah, dealing yourself damage. Please have a one shot. She doesn't. Okay, she needs to de uh, draw as many cards as physically possible. Oh boy. Iron Rodeo. Let's take out the Hitman. Bam! Draw two cards. So it only has to be three decks that have the same keyword. Um, go ahead and pop that a little bit. Yeah, take that down a little bit too. Yes. No. Okay, and she's got nothing but one shots also. Let's do Destroyer's Adagio on top. So this should work. Uh, ooh, make every second count. Skip her power. <coughs> Alright, um, let's play. Hmm. It either needs to be a Commodore or a Drift, so let's do Drift. Uh-oh. That's going to make her draw a card. Well, let's see if it pays off. Next damage dealt by Jackie Strong by two. One shot. Equipment. Ongoing. Ongoing. Damn it. Oh, wait. No, it worked? Are you kidding me? Um, oh, uh, well, Commodore can use another card. Okay, so we're definitely getting a villain play like next time. Oh, the lovers come out. And they gave us a token at the cost of their own sanity. Alright, so if everybody discards a card, we can buy this relic. I've got to put them up, so let's discard be thrown. She's got two of those. We Archer battery comes out. And the cut purse. And the face. Cool. Why is that happening? I don't remember. Oh, because they were all in the trash. <clears throat> uh, definitely playing over to Yale Orchards. Whew. That's rough. Ooh. Ataz? Ah, uh, no, you need to start moving. She can... She can discard. She's fine. She also needs to take time uh, with a wounded hand. Get rid of Undying Enmity before it comes out, or before uh, Tlatawani gets here. No! Stop it! Alright, now we can do the normal things. No. 
yes. Also, yes. <sighs> Play a card. All right, let's harness us some anomalies here. Uh, that's an outfit that needs to go back. Hey, I got an outfit! Which one does, is it? First time they discard a card, they may draw two cards. She puts it on herself. Oh, boy. Discard a special card, they may put it into play. Ooh. Yes, ma'am. Take time, get rid of that crap. Um, yeah, let's, let's leave it. Uh, it's the Medallion of Montezuma. I kind of don't care about that right now. Mm, excuse me. It's fine. Drop the specialist. All right, so I can discard a card. First time, draw a card to destroy an environment or ongoing card. Um, let's do bridal train. I would like that to happen first. Uh, Jackie's fine. She's got her house. Then Sprig and Headdress. Um. Oh, okay, good. And that canceled the card draw. That's how it's supposed to work. Uh, Story card Jahar. This card a card with power. Power printed on it. Let me use that power. Let's put that on Drift. And play Domestic Chic on it. What? Um, you can use other streamers' emotes if you're subscribed to them, usually. Like, because I can use, uh... I can use these guys. All right, uh, made for action. First time each turn the hero next to this guy outfit discards a card. They may play a one shot. Ooh, that might not be bad for her. It gains a hit point, and the hero next to this outfit deals sorts of damage. She talks damage. Hmm, that would be better for Jackie Strong. So let's put that on the star card, Jahar. Let's go ahead and do this. That was just a one shot. Cool. All right, madam. You get to have an easy. <clears throat> put you next to the hitman. Get to have an easy turn. Do I have any trees in my trash? Doesn't say. Ah, there you go. And that's how I got mine too. Yeah, let's go ahead and get the trees back and uh, play a fate fruit. We're doing okay on HP. Boss of the plains and barn raising. Oh, that's why she doesn't want to have the... Oh, whatever. Uh, let's reduce the cost of that and take out the specialist. Once again, my nose is extremely cold. Let us discard throwing shard. Oh, she's not? Whoops, hang on. Sorry. <clears throat> uh, okay, so let's do Destroyer's Adagio. Two damage to Hitman. She moves back. Now she's in the past. And then we use that. And we heal herself. Okay, cool. 
Let's increase the next damage. Drift deals. Hmm, I actually don't want to shift. Uh... Yeah, if I don't shift, I can actually use past focus. Let's just skip her play phase. Nate's heritage, sure. That's fine. Top card of the villain deck is a one shot, okay. Ha, well, hard rains. Cadet cards have no text. Start of the environment turn. Fill in the target with the highest HP deals each environment target three cold damage. And if there's at least one cadet in play, add two tokens to the hero flight pool. If not, they get a bunch of tokens. Okay. I think we'll be alright with that. So. Um. No. It's five. Alright. Um, so yeah. The Commodore can discard two. She doesn't need that. She doesn't need that. Everybody else discard one. Ooh, uh, Jackie, draw a card. <sighs> and now suddenly Debutante has all the cards. Um... Don't need the hat. And then Drift can do two. <clears throat> She's already got this out, right? Yeah. That's out, and I'm not a fan of imposed synchronization. Oh, wait. Oh, and she can play a card. Um, no, I don't want to play a card. Six. Oh, I only had to discard one extra. Whatever. Confident gloating. I think they're uh, randomly assigned every time you play. All right, past focus, yes. All right, reduce the next damage dealt to Jackie Strong. Play a card. Yeah. She's gonna be shifting back and forth like a mad woman here. Uh, and we're there. Let's go ahead and shift forward. Increase the next damage dealt by drift. Debutante can discard a card, no problem. Uh, yeah, I don't need that. <coughs> Ooh, yeah. Uh, Bethrown is going to take out the Hitman for us. Good girl. Put you next to the Archer Battery. Holy balls! Well, that was stupid. Oh, uh, yeah, I do. That shouldn't happen because it's supposed to be... Yeah, she wants that. And then I wanted bow tie on it as well. Oh, it's the Altar of Alchema Pictly. Okay, so we can buy one more relic. Um, and the question is, which one do we not want to have out? Nice. Um, I didn't mean that. Hang on. Cannon portal. Oh, we can get rid of that. Draw two cards. This is actually a pretty good team, other than the fact that all the damage buffs keep being turned against me. Uh, let's do Jackie Strong. She's got... Ooh, Strong Reaction. Yeah, throw that in there. Cider Season! Uh, 
Timeless treasure. Skip that. Uh, no, actually, the archer battery is almost dead. Let's move her next to the face, because he deals damage in bites of two. Debutant needs more cards. Drift needs more cards. And the Commodore always needs more cards. Alright. Actually, that would be very good on Drift. Um, holy shit. Yeah. We're getting 2 HP first. Uh, then we're going to put it into play on Star Card Jahar. I'm going to play Gem Finding Spell. <laughs> no. Yes. Diamond Studs. Okay. Yes. It's a tree. And no. Um, let's see. Who gets what when they discard? This hero is really fucking annoying to play. <laughs> it seems like such a good idea. Gain a hit point, or Drift could use a power. Yeah. Oh boy. Alright, let's use that power first. She is in the future. In the future. I really, I really do. Like, if nobody likes playing her, that's. That's fine. Start the villain turn each non relic villain target against two hit points. Or. Yeah, we want to get rid of the altar. Okay, we're going to buy that. Alright. Now we can use the power. Let's do that. Knight's Heritage. Jackie's next damage. Uh, get rid of the cut purse. Oh, somebody must have thrown something in the dumpster outside. I'm like, they shouldn't be picking up trash. They did that yesterday. Target by one to the starting I actually don't really want to do that, do I? Yeah. Let's play Saber Shard. True. Um, what card was revealed? I don't remember. Oh, Knight's Heritage. Uh, draw a card. Definitely use that. Not playing that. Debutante. Draw a fucking card. Oh my god, are we still in our start phase? Draw two cards. <laughs> like, I thought she was hard to play on Tabletop Simulator. And it's just, no. I just, ooh, gosh. Brilliance Boutique, fuck yeah. Diamond Studs, fuck yeah. Uh, that's going on Moonlight Palaver? Moonlight Palaver, yeah. Okay, um, oh, La Comadora can give us infinite card plays. She doesn't give a damn. She also needs a dress. <laughs> Two or fewer damage than be redirected to another target. Let's do that. Um, drop that, and I can hit the cut purse. And. Oh, that was it actually. Yes. <laughs> uh, eh, that's boring. 
Oh, there's Overdale Orange Hoods. Okay, um... Right. Bowerly, come out. That sure was. And we'll play the Fey Fruit. Apple Tree, put him up. Cool. Good girl, be thrown. We don't need that. <sighs> Shit. <laughs> I gotta remember, she's dealing tons of damage to her own shit. Okay, yeah, we're not gonna hit the trees. <laughs> Alright, she can discard a card with a power on it to use a power, and then also use a power, and also use a power, and also use a power. Where are you right now? Alright, two radiant damage to uh, the altar. Play a one shot, I'm not doing that. And now she's down here. Ah, oh, butts, whatever, I don't care. Ooh, borrowed time. We're still in the future, okay. Oh, poop. Ooh, future focus, hmm. No, we'll draw that. Uh, now let's go ahead and do this because that will do make every second count. Oh, I thought... No, oh, whatever. Okay, what am I doing? Putting a cop card into a play. Debutante. Ah! Whoops. Captain Annalee comes out. Hey, it's one of the Sky Templars. Uh, his card may deal a hero 3 sonic damage. Damage is taken this way at a token of the hero flight pool. May play an extra card and use an extra power. That'll be a drift thing. At least Arjun, <laughs> Arjun Adept would be the least of my worries, honestly. Uh, yeah, so we need to have somebody take damage. It'll probably be drift. Alright, we need... Two cards... Lakamadora. You're good. And um, drift. <clears throat> Alright, she is in orange. Let's hit the face. Ooh, good. That'll take him out. Oh. Uh, where is she at? Position two. Ah, uh, she doesn't really... Okay, let's, yeah, let's do that and go left. Reduce the next damage dealt to herself. <laughs> heal. Actually, I could heal the Fae Fruit. Let's do that. Healing trees is great. Don't need to discard more cards. Don't need to discard more cards. We bought it. Now he flips. Okay. The Helm of Witzitli. Wit Witzitli. And Frenzied Felines. And, oh boy. Shit gets really crazy now. Okay. Yes. Oh, uh, melee. Why not? Booyah. Good job! Holy crap! Temple Defenders, okay. <laughs> ah, ooh. Ow, itch. Um, Jackie can take this. Redirect that shit to Tlatawani himself. Just because it's funny. Oh no. Why does it count top of deck discards? Alright, heal two. Uh, put it into play. What is it? Taffeta cape? No. Draw two cards. 
And I'll let Drift draw cards, I guess. Drift is the one who's doing shit. Uh, oops, no, not that one. She is in one, so let's heal Jackie. <clears throat> Select a card to put on top of the deck. You don't say, oh, I don't need the boutique. All right, let's get rid of the defenders if we can. Not for ship shape. Don't discard for ship shape, for the love of God. Uh, no, she doesn't have extra powers. Oh, you're right. That's a lot of underlines, Tesla. Okay, um, how about your own deck? What do I get? Brick Teleporter. Oh, that's actually pretty good. <laughs> uh, let's play Ring Elena's Plot. That's going to be important. That was odd. Um... The helm? Oh, no, wait. Actually, is that what it does? Oh, never mind. Uh, bottom card of hand, deck, don't do that. Um, let's get rid of the defenders. Who doesn't need cards? The answer is the Comodora. I'm sorry, what just happened? I wasn't paying attention. God damn it. Uh, oh, right, the cats are gone. Holy shit. Uh, do I really want to discard a card? Yeah. Heal. Put it into play. And draw two cards. And then somebody else gets to do a thing. And it'll be like Commodore. <clears throat> mm hmm. Yes! Actually, I want her to hit herself. Oh, that's great! She was motivated to try harder. I love it. Ah, uh, you came up with some great stuff, Origami. Uh, hmm. Okay, are any of these. Oop, Frightful Fade has one too many A's in it. This card's a card that means a little damage to him. Okay, that's going on Jackie, which is Moonlight Pull Offer. Kind of, yeah. Deals damage. Oh, this is also going on Jackie, so she's full up on designs now. Oh, what? Oh, never mind. Hang on. It should be if there's more than three. Oh no, there is. Okay, I see. Okay, I'm not, I'm not reading this properly. She's full up. She could actually get one. Um, yeah, let's throw that on her. I need to remember. Okay, power number one. Um, let's play a gem finding spell. No, yes. Booyah. Sure. Her soul gem. Awesome. For when guys copies Rainbow's house. Oh, that's great. No. Um, Jackie, discard a card. Deal a target to damage of any type. Uh, let's just do melee. Pow. Uh, and then... Do the next damage off them by two. Sure. La Commodora needs a dress. And she gets that one. Cool. 
We're gonna have to sudden notion one of those. Uh, damage. <laughs> uh, no, we won't do that. No, oh, she's got extra powers. Okay, we'll do that to her too. Discard that. Deal some damage. Oh, excuse me. Uh, let's hit the amulet. Yes. Do you want to deal damage? No. Do not punch the captain of the Sky Templars. Damn it, Jackie! I said no. <laughs> Beating a dead tree. And uh, soul strength. In fact, let's just do as much damage as humanly possible. That being six. Quick kick. Uh, all right, boom. Him and the amulet. We're gonna, we're gonna harvest some shit here, boy howdy. Don't need that. <clears throat> and the amulet is down. I would just like to play Transition Shock. That That's all I need. Yes. Oh, cool. Oh, great. So where are we at? Knight's Heritage first. Shift right. Increase next damage. Drift deals. Hopefully that works. Oh, I didn't get to past focus. I don't get why that doesn't work sometimes. Transition Shock, please. What's her other power? Oh, it's throwing shard, right? Let's play that then. Yeah. Do that. Um, most damage is going on the villain. Be thrown can go on Platawani, I guess. Let's put her on the helm. I don't know. Yes. Draw a card and shift right. Let's do it. <laughs> Damn it, Jackie! Hmm. Bethrona is never going to leave that card unless I move her. <laughs> Oh, who wants to play the top card of their deck? How about... Drift. Wow! Oh. Okay, won't do that again. Matan Hagar. Oh, he's the big guy. Use damage to environment targets by one. The first time this card is dealt damage each turn at a token of the hero flight pool. And he heals at the start of the turn. He's a nice guy. Ooh, shoot. Okay. We need, we need to think about order here, and the order is kill the trees first. Beat that dead tree. No. Although there is an ongoing I can get rid of. Yes. Kick his ass. Let's wait until the third tree is destroyed. And then, oh, well, okay, fine, whatever. Uh, and then hit her herself. Yes. Take that, you shit. That was, what, 12 damage outside of her turn? Position 3, select card, go right. Increase next damage dealt by Jackie Strong. Ha! <laughs> 
<laughs> Punch yourself in the dick. Oh boy. Ooh. Yes. <clears throat> Yeah. Ah, <laughs> uh, sure. <clears throat> yeah, steel damage. Uh, toxic damage. That was fun. Booyah. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, she's all the way over there, so... Yeah. Two radiant damage. Um... I think we can just probably kill him. Yes. Select the target. Reduce next damage dealt to herself. Shit. Alright. I think it's time for... Uh... Didn't actually want to do that. I think it's time for chronological sweet spot. There, now we discard cards. Yes. Oh my god. <laughs> um, no, because she won't take any damage. Don't care about that. Oh. Cool. No, I think she's discarded enough, thank you. Yep. My laptop's fan is heating up my glass. <clears throat> Alright, there's nothing in her trash. Uh, cannon portal. Hit the big man himself. Who needs this? Everybody but her. <clears throat> Darn. Oh. <laughs> Shit. I'm sorry. What is this? Hang on. Reduce the next damage dealt to Lacomodoro by 16. Hey, Angeal! How's it going? Staunch work ethic. Eh. Heal some fool. Uh, Jackie needs cards. We want her to deal all the damage on her turn. No. Don't worry about that. That would actually be very good for Lakomodora, so proving ground. That sounds really good. Uh, training record first. Portable wardrobe. I just... I don't even... Two designs in trash. That's fine. Let's hit him. And also that. Nah. Also, where the fuck is her deck? <laughs> <laughs> Friendship lasers. Afogato? Uh, oh yeah, Jackie, please discard a card. Yes. Ooh, Resplendence! Ah, oh, her cat came out. Almost killed the villain. I love it. And here we go. Bam! Okay, that worked out real good. We're gonna do one more game. <laughs> Alright, so give me a villain, give me an environment, give me a cannon hero, give me a cauldron hero. Uh, I don't remember if anybody said anything previously. Oh, that's right, you wanted the desolation of time, didn't you? 
Yeah, and I still, it still was such a chore to fucking play her. Uh, so the last two are going to be Party Popper and Rainbow Rider. I am so chilly. It's Rainbow Rider, where the fuck is... Oh, there she is. <clears throat> oh yeah, and by the way, they all have at least... I think they all have at least two variants. I'm gonna... Give me, give me things to pick. I'm gonna go grab my gloves real quick. This is why this month's electric bill was so low. It's freaking cold in here. Chrono Ranger, okay. Come on. Chrono Ranger, um, that's fine. Let's put him up there. Uh, so yeah, you wanted the, the uh, cutie remark stand in, which is the decimation of time. <laughs> ah, that's right, I saw you were planning on taking those down. I mean, it's the safe thing to do. What does he do? Play a bounty card. If you do so, Time Slinger deals up bounties, target one projectile damage. Oh, that's not bad. That's pretty good, actually. Uh, and we need, we need a cauldron hero, we need a villain. Unless somebody said something and I didn't see it, which is always possible. Gyrosaur, I love it. Mm, excuse me. I guess we could just fight the Equalizer since this is her environment. <gasps> she appears in it twice. I like... which one do I like most? I'm just gonna play bass. Okay, let's go ahead and just do the equalizer. So she's going to come here and try and equalize us. That's going to be interesting. I want to see how this was implemented, too. And we finally get to see one of the lines that I wrote for a hero. Welcome to our humble village where all are equal. Oh, wow, villain! I've got a few pranks up my sleeve they're sure to enjoy. Also... Party Popper has some of the best lines. Please, somebody, um, put her first in your party when you go to fight Oblivion. The Empty Village. Oh boy, stuff is here. Don't forget things. Uh, discards a card or destroys one of their cards. Now who's got cards? Well, the uh, uh, Gyrosaur can. Discard Omnivore. All right, yeah, so she's got three random spells under the Empty Village. Uh, she's indestructible, so is Soul Gem Reveal, which is not here yet. Um, the heroes ever have no cards in hand, they've been equalized, game over. And when the hero regains HP, they must discard a card. I, yeah, Marine Refuge is easily my favorite. Okay, uh, the savvy will notice that these are pranks. <clears throat> And this is the reason why I made that deck. Uh, reveal the top card of each deck. Reveal discard the rest of the one. That's not bad. Pranking paraphernalia. Let's 
Don't need that. Or I could just play Gimbal. He's pretty good. Now let's start with the pranking paraphernalia and play sneezing powder. Ooh, candy copter. Uh, discard a card? No. Yay. <laughs> it's not, really. Uh, sudden contract? We're going to make this go fast. And we're actually going to skip his power because there's no other... Uh... Actually, no. I don't have to. So what I can do is pull that back and then put it back and then hit her. Okay, that's cool. Stunt time. Do 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 do. Oh, we do have a routine. All right, let's get ourselves up to Apollo salute. Ooh, a good butt kicking. Fuck the routine. <laughs> I'm gonna smack her around. Just wham, wham, wham. Ah, discard card. Um, that one. Do a barrel roll. No crash cards. Ah, uh, yeah, this would be a very good environment to do that with. What did we get? Temporal Waypoint. Okay, good. Good, that's a worthwhile card to have in the pocket. God, I love Gyrosaur so much. Hmm. No, we can deal with the face swarm, that's no problem. Yes, let's destroy Sneezing Powder. <clears throat> Soul Sepulcher, Unprankable. Eye on the prize. Aerial Relay. Terrifying Momentum. And the Despoiler herself. Yeah, when she, when she does the Desolation of Time, she goes from being the Equalizer to the Despoiler. Uh, time Slinger, why not? Just kill that. Why not? Yeah. You can take the damage. Whoops. No, hang on. Once again, I accidentally clicked no. Discard a card, sir. You can get that back later. Yeah. <clears throat> Ah, oh, the proselytizer comes out. He is an empty. He has been equalized. Or she, actually. <laughs> you can tell when I, uh... When I got, uh, tired of making up flavor text because it's, like, almost exactly the original. Ah... Uh. So we can take it. All right. Um, Rainbow Rider is going to have to do this. Get rid of one of those. Paralyzing Burst hits Rainbow Rider, and she cannot deal damage. Figures. Ooh. That one, since she can't deal damage, and okay. Candy Copter lets me do what? All right. Now let's throw Gimbal out now, um, and then we will go ahead and reduce next damage dealt by the Equalizer, because we'll probably kill the other one. You know what this calls for? No. 
Ooh. Tumblr's exhibition, barrel roll, Paul salute. Okay, let's do a barrel roll into the routine. Ooh, can also do some amazing acrobatics. There we go. <clears throat> awesome. Gyro stabilizer, hooray. Oh, uh, no, that's fine. How would that work? That sounds cool. World of Conflict. Each villain target deals a hero target two melee damage. The hero target takes damage this way. It deals the source of damage one melee damage. That's okay. There's only two villain targets. Uh, hit party popper. Bam. And you can hit... Time Slinger? No, Rainbow Rider. The Surveiller. Alright, so either Gyrosaur or Rainbow has to do this. Oh dear, not her. That was an easy choice. I'm actually, let me get rid of Sphere Devastation. I don't. I can't remember if hurting her actually matters or not. I think it does, but let's 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 throw a party. I feel like the invisible ink is the good idea. Excuse me. I'm going to play a card. Um. She is going to give Gyrosaur a cupcake. There you go. And. Uh. Let's just do Chrono Ranger. Oh, wait. Shoot. Well, whatever. Well, that's right. I moved the bounty, so... Okay. Let's go ahead and discard and draw. Ooh, another candy copter. Go... Yeah, go there. Actually sounds kind of neat. Displaced armory. Hat. Always hat. <laughs> Get wrecked. Ah, <laughs> oh, he got eaten. Let's go ahead and do temporal grenade. There's a good chance that that'll go away, but you never know. Ooh, home of the clouds. Daring rescue. Paula salute. We're amazing acrobatics. Um, let's just go ahead and amazing acrobatics into Apollo salute. Ooh, yeah. So two players. That'll be Chrono Ranger and Party Popper. <laughs> All right, Hyper Spin, Wipeout.
Oh, you can't change it for both of those. Whoop. Oh, sorry, Gimbal. You got flattened. Hang on. Oh, that's right. You have to hit her to make her do that. Shit. Lieutenant Portinoff. No, we want her to come out. She's good. Boom. <clears throat> the devotee. Ah, uh, Chrono Ranger will do this. We'll get rid of the Masada. Freeze Crystal. And Kiro cannot use powers. Um, Party Popper can do that. Ooh! She took no damage. Stormy Surprise. Yeah, let's throw that on Chrono Ranger. Can't use powers. Uh, yeah. Oh, shoot. Oh, well. Oh, right! We can't draw more than one hero card. Um, Ranger's Mark. Danny Boy? Get rid of his ass. Mm, excuse me. Here's some flash exhibition, aerial flower. Um let's lay home in the clouds and just heal. She takes a nap. Do you read the terrain? Let's just do it again. Sure. <clears throat> oh. World of Midnight. Yes, we will swap that out for the temporal waypoint. feeling all the empties come back. He keeps getting hit by him. That was weird. Helicopter time. Put my hand and the other into play. Let's put the old switcheroo in hand. Huh. 
Mm-hmm. Um, actually, no, that's okay. It just, it confused me super big. Uh, no. Uh, um, you, sir, confuse yourself. Hmm. Huh. Dangerous dive. Him. That's when this power really comes in handy. Go ahead and do protective escort. Also, how much damage has she been dealt? One damage. Fuck. Um, she is the highest. Protect her from sonic damage, I guess. <clears throat> yeah. Take damage to use a power. Um, kind of worth it for him? Not really, no. Nobody's got the ability to do enough damage. Face swarm, whatever. Nope, good at that. It's all heroes. So it's it's a very difficult lose condition to actually hit. Although I'm doing pretty good. Uh, let's destroy one for non-character cards. Take that, you shit. Corecasty's time portal. Oh, man. Old switcheroo is a little too hard to use. Um, I want protective escort so I can draw more cards. Nice. Now we don't have to worry about hitting her this round. Oh, and also that flipped, so. Oh, the Provisioner came out. Do it again. We will giggle at the Equalizer. No. Uh, take out the Proselytizer. Mm-hmm. Chrono Ranger, sir, what is your major malfunction? Alright, she's immune to damage. Let's just take out the face swarm. Hunter and Hunted, great. Oops. Why don't you heal some? Escort again. Let's make Party Popper immune to energy damage. <clears throat> Maybe she'll get to deal damage eventually. Again, don't need to use a power. Those cards are going away. Oh, wait. Actually, that's not true. Um, who could take her out? She has three crash cards. I mean, let's try it. Oops. 
Oh. Nope, that was not enough. Oh, wait. Not true. Hmm. No. Slip through time is fun. Provisioner. There we go. Well done. Nope. She flipped. Temple Concordance comes out. Everybody draw two cards. <laughs> Paralyzing Burst. Ooh, nice. Danny boy, go for it. Uh, 3 energy damage, Party Popper. Ooh, let's put the top card of her deck into play. Joy Buzzer. <laughs> That's why she's great. Oh boy, three hero ongoing enter equipment cards. Hidden Deeds where can go. Uh, can of Snakes can go. And... Hmm... I'll read the terrain can go. Don't need that. Bye, sister. Another slip through time? Oh my god. I've never had two of those out at once. Cupcake mistake. Oh, jeez. Uh, I think she's going to get m massively wrecked here. <clears throat> Stop hitting yourself. Oh my god, this is great. Stormy surprise on... Time Slinger. Sneezing Powder and Invisible Ink. Let's do Sneezing Powder. <gasps> uh, nope. She can hit herself. Ooh. Um. Yeah. I, th I think she's dead this turn. Like, there's no question here. Yeah, terrible tech strike. Boom. That's what happens when you play Chrono Ranger, as we learned. Oh, really? Oh, well, that's why she hurt herself. I didn't read it closely enough. Okay, that's it for this one, guys. Thanks so much for coming and enjoying this craziness with me. Uh, there's links to find it all over the place. Actually, let me, um, let me actually put it in the chat in case anyone doesn't have it. The mod's name is Legend of Kalistar. If you want it, there's a link to it. And if you missed that link, then you can go check it out on, uh, Born Game Geek or something. But, yeah, I'll, I'll see you all again, hopefully on Sunday night or Sunday morning for uh, Sentinel Sunday. So, till then, take care and have a good one.